Hi you guys, we're back with another reaction video. Woo uh, in this reaction video, we are reacting to if you build a house, I will pay for it. Let's go <laughs> see what this is gonna be about. Obviously, you know. But before we get into this video, make sure you smash the like button, comment down below, and subscribe to Rand Nation. If you're new. Oh, yep. Let's go. One hundred Minecraft players here, and whoever builds the best house in one hour gets a real house. This is baloney. Server, start the game. I'm gonna go tell them. Whichever one of you builds the best this looking cat. house gets a real house. Oh, oh, God. God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Good luck. Oh, is this a basketball goal? Okay, he got a, a driveway. <gasps> what? TP to me right this instant. The pineapple. Oh, if he makes SpongeBob's house, that might win him a house. Oh my god. I'll be lit. I think I see another pineapple over there. His skin is SpongeBob. Look at him. We noticed you're building SpongeBob's house, big boy. And if you look over there, you'll see someone else's. No way someone cannot build SpongeBob's house. Kind of looking like a manga, man. You better step it up. You viewers are probably wondering, how can you compete in something like this? Just hit the subscribe button down below. We're actually going to give $10,000 to someone who subscribes to the next week. Jimmy, have you ever seen a house with chicken? You think it's real? How would they know? Mm. Oh my gosh, this is so gross. Chicken legs? Well, I'm judging based on if it has chicken legs. It's been roughly 15 minutes, and look at everything everyone has built so far. This is going to be hard to judge. It's not supposed to be easy to give away a house, Jimmy. And our special <laughs> guest for this Bats. video is Tubbo. He's in a different call, and he can't hear us. What is Carl doing? Carl's just running on her build, not even helping. First he wakes me up, and, that, and now he doesn't even assist. That's messed up. Hey, hey. Look how terrible this pineapple is. Yeah. It looks like a house from someone who doesn't want a house. Oh, Carl, look at your chicken leg house. Yeah, Jimmy, the more and more I look at this chicken leg house, the more I just want to move right now. Jimmy, look at my tree house. Look how cool this one is. Obviously, right now it looks pretty terrible, but I see the potential. Hey, has no mind. Keep working. Oh, we should do one of those, like, like the little eyebrow windows on the roofs. I, I don't know, know what you're talking about. <laughs> the eyebrow windows. Tumble's got some steep competition to his left. Bruh. A Supreme house. What? Bruh. Supreme, that's Supreme lit. house. I don't see anyone. So, like... Someone just built the Bream house oh, Bream. and left. Yeah, how do we never catch them? Even if they won, I wouldn't be able to give them their house because they're not here. Who do you think will win? If they can complete this, I think this is top three. Hello? What is up? Your building is massive. What are you doing? I'm trying to make a skyscraper. What are your thoughts on your skyscraper. competitors' houses? I'm just really shaking right now and stressing. If you're better than all these houses over here, you get a house. Good luck. Thanks. I don't know if it will necessarily be good, but I like how it looks. So we're going to go with it. Judge, stop what you're doing. I got time. You think he's really going to give us my house? I think it's cat. Cat. Houses could be like a thousand dollars. No, they can't. I mean, that's how much trailers are. Not for you. So, I just dropped a stack of 64 TNT and here's a flint and steel. You have one minute to sabotage whoever you want. Hey, Jed, you know you don't have to. I mean, that's true, but... It would be fun, though, right? It would be funny. Jed, I love Jed, I love Jed, oh my god, Jed, you savage! Jed, I look at it, look at it. Notice how the house didn't explode? It was a test. And you failed the test! Bad Jed. Sorry. Alright, I'm gonna try Mr. Bacon. Let's see if he has the heart of gold. Uh, Mr. Bacon. Hey, how you doing? Mr. Bacon, I have a challenge for you. Here's a stack of 64 TMT and a blend steel. You have one minute to sabotage whoever you want. You don't have to sabotage anyone, but if you want, you can. I think I'll play some, but I won't light it off. I'll just kind of like sneak it in the inside here. Somebody stop this madness. So Bacon, are you igniting it or not? No. Well then, congratulations Bacon, you just passed the test! Woo! And Bacon, since you were the first person to not try to screw over another player, I'm giving you a Chandler. Chandler, awesome. More of a hindrance, Mr. Bacon. Tubbo's house is starting to look pretty good, not gonna lie. Oh, we still have to do the inside. Yeah, you get walking on the inside. Do, do the floors, do the floors. Oh my gosh. Next house. Oh, that looks cool. That no. one right there. Time is up. Oh. Ow! Uh, Babe! Why are you, like, just spread out like that? You're mansplaining right now. It's too late to add anything else. We gotta go with what we got. We are going to go through and judge every house starting with this one. And don't forget, whichever house gets the highest score gets a literal house! It's Cat. really creative. I'm gonna give it a five. 
That's the best house I've ever seen. I'm giving it a five as well. I'm gonna go with four. Damn. You're currently in first place with 14 Ooh. points, because it's the only house we've judged. Woo! Okay, this one has potential. Whoa! There's even... Oh! Oh, look at the name of the fishes. Jimmy. Chandler. That's, that is creative. Oh, you're the clownfish. I'm the... Okay. He said you're a clown. What are you gonna give him after that? Oh! He made a scarecrow! That is cool. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna go seven and a half for the swing. I'm gonna give him a seven and a half as well. I'm like giving him an eight. eight. He is in first place with 23 points. Carl, it's time for the first SpongeBob house! Yeah! Here we go! Before I go inside, I just want to point out there's nothing in the backyard. This pineapple is it. Wow, okay, we got the TV and the chair. But where's Gary? Why is he so low? Yeah, why is he stare so hard to get up? This is affecting my score. What is he doing? Credit where credit's due, he did put a lot of effort into this. Creativity yeah. wise, pretty obvious we like cartoons. I'm That's lit, they can go inside. I'm sorry, Blue Lost Sky, I'm gonna have to give this a seven. I'm going six and a half. Well, luckily, this isn't our only pineapple. Maybe one of the other ones got it right. And next is that one was cold. Did he even put anything in it, or is it just hollow? It is hollow, but hear me out. He got all of this done in the same amount of time it took this guy to do that. <laughs> I don't know if I have to live here considering it has nothing. I'll give it a six. Even though we had the kid in the call earlier and I liked him, so you're gonna have to give it a seven. One of those six, seven, eighters. The next house is floating, but it's missing a roof. He didn't even finish. Mom came in his room and was like, Johnny, you gotta go to school. I could win a house, Mom. Poor Johnny. <gasps> Ten. Ten. This one's definitely creative. Ten. He recreated the up house. It's the house from up. Ten. The guy that owns this house is named Carl. How Don't scratch me. There he is. Get in here. How'd he do that? Oh, that's pretty creative. Dude, I gotta give this a, a eight and a half. Carl overjudged. I wouldn't say it's a ten. It's a ten. I'm gonna have to subtract a point from my score to counteract Carl. So I'm gonna give him. Which house are you liking best? I like that one a lot. I like the uh, uh, the one with the uh, fishes. Oh yeah, that was good yeah. too. I don't think it's a perfect house. 25 and a half. Congrats on first place. Oh, pandas out front. Bro, this is from Club Penguin. This is the dojo. It's Karjitsu Dojo. Yeah, this is a nine. This is a nine for sure. I'll give them an eight. This is the first place now. Woo! Up next, we have another SpongeBob house. Look, he has Squidward. Patrick and Spongebob Tower. Yeah, but to be fair, in uh, Spongebob, they're side by side. This is more diagonal. There's nothing in Patrick's house. He neglected the interior. Where's Patrick's house? Four. All right, Come he on. lost. He can't Where's win. Oh! All right, Mr. Bacon, welcome back to the call. Hello. Carl, oh, come on, come on. Back Hello. Upstairs. I like the rooms. I'm going to give it a nine. I live here. Chandler, what are you rating? It's dark. It's an eight and a half. I'm going to give it a seven. Bacon, are you happy with your rating? Yeah, that sounds pretty good. You're not in first place. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Next house. I love you. This next house you. is in a snow globe. I think that's very creative. That's and awesome. you're in the, oh my gosh. You're in a snow globe. Oh, that should go. First person to use dogs. All right, I'm back from my doctor's appointment. I'm going to judge the next house. See, that's a green screen. We should, uh, where you oh, can get a, a, a green cloth. Uh, yeah. House. Oh yeah, I get that, like the dumb. Welcome to my mochi pounding tradition. Ooh, what I love about making okay. mochi is that Almost stickiness. Done. It really ruins. <laughs> Wait a second. Chandler, what happened to your voice? What do you mean? You got dumber. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Ow. It hurts. Oh. If you don't free me, you'll be on my naughty list. <laughs> Dude, this might be my second 10 out of 10. I like it a lot. This is very creative. I'm giving it a 9. 9. He is currently in first place. Victory! Oh, okay. that's cool! This guy's claiming victory before we even give it to him. Look in the basement for a secret, it says. Trust me, I'm crewmate. <laughs> We're venting. Mr. B's secret team key story. Oh, nice! The chest say L O L. That's funny. Oh, there's shrimp on the ceiling! I'm, I'm giving him an 8. I'll go 8.5. 9. Didn't win. That was close, Damn. though. That's a good one. Oh, wait. Listen to the jingle when you get closer. He made this. Oh, this is the Inator. Doofus vs. Evil Incorporated. I'm going to be completely honest. This is the most amount of work I've ever seen somebody put into it. I'm, I'm giving it a 10. Nine. Well, guess what, boys? I give it a zero because it already won. Dang, dude. Well, Carl, I know you're about to rate the chicken leg. Yeah. But before you do, oh, I'm going to give it a five so it can't win. What up, Tubbo? Hey! Cool. It's time for us to raid your house. You want to show us around, Tubbo? I'll give you the tour. So, um, it's much more of an outside house than an inside, because the inside's a little bit cramped. And upstairs, we've got, like, 
let's not go upstairs. <laughs> Back over here, we have we have a lovely little path that goes to a, a barbecue area where we're making no burgers. Then over here, we made a Christmas tree. Uh, Carl. No, okay. Thank you, Carl. This is a solid six and a half. You know what? Since Shayla gave you a six and a half, I'll give you a ten just for the memes because you still didn't win. Woo! It was good though. It was good. It just wasn't the best. How about you have five seconds to say whatever you want? Um. I wouldn't be able to do that. Me um, either. <laughs> just watching it, I'm like. <laughs> His was the best. Yeah. Okay, so visually, I would give it a 10 because that was really cool. Yeah. The igloo was my favorite, personally. Same. I like it a lot. Like, yeah. It was interesting. Like It was funny. It was like it, it was entertaining. Yeah, I like it. Must, a lot. I'm going to um, check in on the, more of those videos. So I comment know. down below. Let us know what you think. think. About this video. Well, we'll see y'all in the next video. If you're new, subscribe and hit the like button. And, and we're.